been playing handball since I was 10 years old. And I'm 55, so I've been playing over 40 years. Oh, now it's, it's competitive because it's Olympic sport now. So it's international game, which was originally a street game, but the people that invented handball is not even from this country, they're from Ireland. Ireland invented handball, and now it's everywhere. You know, I'm the one that invented A and B, because there was no such thing as that type of game. That's like an A player, which is a player that gets a card like I have, and a B player that's trying to get that card that I have. So you team them together, so it makes it even. Because nobody wants to go up against two A players, because they know they ain't got a chance. So you break it down, you put a weaker player with a greater player. So it makes it a good combination. First person, I was 16 years old. In, in high school, they never had handball, but at the old Edison High School, I was the first person to win the doubles tournament. We didn't have official handball trophies, so they gave me a trophy and they cut the tennis racket off the guy's hand, so the little handle looked like a ball in his hand. That was the first official handball trophy in Philadelphia, and I, I won second place just for one day a week, Tuesday, I'm with the kids. I want them to, right. to stop thinking He's about right. selling drugs right. or, or robbing right. people. So it's right. a couple of hours right. no a, a week. You could be with me, play handball, and have fun. No, that was out. That Pay was $6. Out. Exactly, it was out, I ain't gonna lie. Winner take all. No, it was out, I saw it. That's it. The very first game I played, against my teacher, I lost. You were 10? I was 10 years old. I used to play basketball. So it was one day, I'm walking by, I said, and I seen this guy hitting the ball, he's going like this, going like that, can you teach me that? He said, yeah, I can teach you, but you gotta work hard at this. You gotta be here every day at eight in the morning. If you're not, then I can't teach you, so I have to do it every day. Yeah, my name is BJ Flood. I'm from New York, but I'm from Philly now, and I'm here to stay.